Hello guys, welcome to ASP Hero. Today we are going to solve a problem on a straight line. We have given a problem. Find the equation of the line through minus 1, 3, 2 and perpendicular to the plane x plus 2y plus 2z equals to 3. And find length of the perpendicular and the coordinate of its foot. At first, before solving it, before solving or going to the main solution, we will see its main concept, what the question is saying. Okay. First, in question we have given minus 1, 3, 2. A point is given. That point is this point. Okay. And uh, the line containing this point is perpendicular to this plane. That means this is a plane. Okay. This is a plane. This is a plane and it has equation x plus 2y plus 2z equals to 3. What we have to find is find the equation of the line containing this point. Containing this point. Okay. Now we have to find this line. We have to find this line and we have to find the length of perpendicular. Means we have to find this length also okay we have to find length also and then we have to find its foot okay foot means this is a perpendicular and this is foot of the perpendicular okay this is foot in this way we have to find three things here one we have to find the equation second length and third foot foot means a point okay let's see start okay we have a solution equation of the line through equation of the line through minus 1 3 2 is x minus x1 upon a y minus y1 upon b z minus z1 upon c okay and equation of line through minus 1 3 2 and another condition is also given and perpendicular 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 to x plus 2y plus 2z equals to 3 is this okay now in x1 y1 and z1 we have minus 1 3 2 and in a b c we have this one here two here two okay this is a b c one two two we'll use okay now x minus x1 is minus 1 so plus 1 by a is 1 then y minus 3 by b is 2 Finally, z minus z1 that is 2 and c is also 2 okay now since we have to find the coordinates of its foot and length also therefore we can suppose here is r that is you can write c okay here some light is focusing here now x equals to r minus 1 y equals to 
2r plus 3 z equals to 2r plus 2 okay now we have got x y and z in terms of r now we have to find r also to get the exact point okay for getting r we know this point lies in the equation x plus 2y plus 2z equals to 3 therefore it lies in equation x plus 2y plus 2z equals to 3 therefore r minus 1 plus 2 into 2r plus 3 2r plus 3 um, plus 2 into z value is 2r plus 2 okay now equals to 3 equals to r minus 1 plus 2 to the 4 r plus 3 to the 6 plus 4 r plus 4 minus 3 equals to 0 okay now let us change the position man let us change the position this light is not giving to work properly it's okay yes uh, it's hard to make tutorial guys okay all clear yes up to now now we will solve this after solving, we will get value of R. Value of R will be 2 by 3. Okay. R equals to 2 by 3. To solving you don't have to write this okay solve and you will get r equals to 2 by 3 now therefore coordinate of is foot m is you know where is m this is a line given and this is foot, foot is m, okay. And given point is p, okay. Given point is already minus 1, 3, 2, and m will right here. Now m is mm, x equals to r minus 1 plus 2 minus 2 by 3 equals. 2 by 3 minus 1 equals 2 minus 2 minus 3 by 3 equals 2 minus 5 by 3 okay similarly y is 2r plus 3 this r minus and this in terms of r we have already got x y z we just putting value of r in x y z okay then 2 into minus 2 by 3 plus 3 to minus 4 by 3 plus 3 equals to 5 by 3 okay after that z value 2r plus 2 equals to 2 into minus 2 by 3 equals 2 by 3 plus 2 equals 2 minus 4 by 3 plus 2 2 by 3 okay and then you can see coordinate of its foot is therefore coordinate of its foot 
is um, m is 5 by 3 5 by 3 2 by 3 okay this is 3 in this way we get m minus 5 by 3 5 by 3 2 by 3 minus 5 by 3 5 by 3 2 by 3 m minus 5 by 3 5 by 3 2 by 3 okay now what we have to find is its perpendicular that is the length okay we have to find the length you have to find this length okay this line is p to m okay pm length of perpendicular is what is length of perpendicular we have formula x2 minus x1 square plus y2 minus y1 square z2 minus z1 square goes to root Minus 5 by 3 plus 1 square plus 5 by 3 minus 3 square plus 2 by 3 minus 2 square goes to root minus 2 by 3 square plus 5 minus 9 by 3 square 2 minus 6 by 3 square 4 by 9 plus 5 minus 9 here we have um, 3 the what we have 3 the 9 minus 5 okay, that is 9 minus 5 4 4 is square 16 16 by 9 plus 2 minus 6 4 by 3 4 is square 16 by 3 9 okay In this way get root 16 16 32 32 plus 4 36 by 9 equals to 6 by 3 equals to 2 is the final answer Okay guys, this is the final answer of the problem. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any problems, please ask in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new to our channel. And please, if you like it, then don't forget to like. And if you have any questions related, please, please ask on comment section. I will try to give my best. Thank you guys, have a nice day.